Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Um, today, I wanted to let you know that I got some new solar panels. And when I say new, I mean new to me because they are used solar panels. They are poly, polycrystalline, is that how you say it? Monocrystalline, polycrystalline. They are polycrystalline ch uh, panels. I believe they are one, two, three by six. They are 60 cell panels. And I got them from Santan Solar in Arizona. Um, the great part about it was that I only wanted four and uh, you have to get bulk shipping on them but my uh, my father was actually in Arizona and he picked up these panels for me for $53 a piece what $53 got me was uh, a 250 watt polycrystalline panel so I paid you know a little over a little over $200 for one kilowatt of panels now I've already tested these panels and they all tested good. Um, I've already set them up as you can see with my PVC, uh, my PVC brackets and those are working well. Or I guess I should say my PVC, I set them up with my PVC stands. Um, I've tested them all and they all produce electricity just fine. Uh, but they've never really been tested in perfect conditions. And when I say perfect, as in uh, zero cloud cover for the entire day. And as you can see, today, today is supposed to be a zero cloud day. And this has been the very first zero cloud day that I can even remember uh, this year. So. We are going to see how these panels work. Um, I will give you the specs on these panels to let you know, uh, uh, you know, the, the the operating voltage and the and the amperage, and also I will give you a link in the description for uh, for Santan Solar. Again, 53 bucks. I think these panels are going to do great. Now, I must say that these panels did uh, they. I replaced 200 watt panels with these 250 watt panels and um, they are still connected to the same charge controller as my 200 watt panels were and that is only a 30 amp charge controller so that's another thing I'm going to be wa uh, watching throughout the day uh, because a 24 volt system you should only really be able to get about, uh, you know, a little, over 800, probably 840 watts max when you hit, when you hit uh, 30 amps. So we'll see, we'll see if this, uh, if this maxes out my, my solar charge controller. And then that way I know that I'll need to be, uh, I'll need to be upgrading my solar charge controller when I actually put four more panels uh, right out right out here I'm gonna be moving I'm gonna be moving these four down this way toward right at the edge of these panels and then my hope is to get my other four panels set up on this side right here so it's gonna be it's kind of it's gonna kind of go around like that and then so this whole this whole south facing side of my house is gonna be full of panels so again, yeah, these panels, let me, let me go ahead and get a close-up shot of them. There is, there's a little bit of like, uh, I guess like sun staining or I'm not really sure what that's called. There's no snail trails that I can see at all. Um, the, backs of, the backs of them do have slight cracking. Uh, but I believe, I believe that won't be an issue at all. So yeah, you can see right there, you can kind of see some, uh, some discoloration. Uh, but again, I don't think it, I don't think it uh, affects the, the production of the, of the panel. But again, no snail trails. 
So, uh, yeah. I'll let you know uh, when it gets to when it gets to be up around noon how these panels are producing. All right, everyone, it is high noon. As you can tell, it's a little windy. My hair looks beautiful. Uh, what I wanted to show you is that these panels in perfect sunlight, look at that, there's not a cloud in the sky. No clouds. But in perfect sunlight, let's see if I can get this in there, but these, uh, these panels, they're the west panels and they're producing 790 watts of electricity. So almost 800 watts of electricity. Uh, which I would say for uh, for $53 a piece and getting 80% you know, 80% out of them, that's, uh, or I guess you could say 79%, but uh, you know, 79, 80%, uh, I would say that's a great deal. So uh, again, if you want to go to Santan Solar and pick up some pretty inexpensive s solar panels, um, I would say go for it. The only thing is that uh, the more you buy, the better because they ship them out in pallets. And it can be, uh, you know, $150, $200 for shipping. So if you're going to get used panels, you know, get a whole pallet. They'll save you the most money. So uh, you guys all take care and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.